take the next topic for mathematical mode. And that topic is construction of truth table for given statement pattern. Now, what is mean by statement pattern? Statement pattern is the combination of two or more statements. If there are two or more statements in the given compound statement, then that compound statement is called statement pattern. Now, today we are constructing the truth table for the given statement pattern. Before constructing the truth table for the given statement pattern, we must remember the truth table of conjunction, disjunction, implication, double implication and negation. So we have to use that basic truth table for the construction of truth table of given statement pattern. Now see one example. So consider example as P or P and Q. Conditional negation. So this is the given statement pattern. And for this statement pattern, we have to construct the truth table. Now, while constructing the truth table, first see how many statements used in the given statement pattern. Now, in this statement pattern, only two statements are used. First statement is P and second is Q. Then there is use of Q, but it is negation. Means basically, there are only two statements, P and Q. So, therefore, first draw the column for P, next draw the column for Q. Now, after getting basic statements, column of basic statement, now use the combination. Now, first find the value of that is P and Q. So, after getting the value of that, after getting the column P and Q, this bracket joined with negation Q, but here we don't have negation Q and first find the value of negation Q. Now, then join two brackets by implication. So, P and Q, conditional negation Q. So, in this way, first draw the columns for the given statement value. Now, after Drawing the columns, now use the possibilities of statement. In statement is either true or false. Where there are two statements, there are only four possibilities and that possibilities are both are true, first true, second false, first false, second true and last both are false. So these are the possibilities when there are two statements. Now, here, in this term, P and Q means P joined with Q by and then conjunction. So for conjunction, for conjunction, when both are true, it is true. True false, it is false. False true, it is false. False false, it is false. So this is for conjunction. Now here, in this column, we want negation Q means negation of Q means if it is true, Q is true, then its negation is false. If Q is false, then its negation is true. So therefore, write opposite value of Q. True, so therefore negation is false. False, negation is true. True, negation is false. False, negation is true. Next. Now, in the last column, we have to join two columns. So this is our first column, joined with negation Q by so, first we have to take the value of this bracket. Then this value joined with negation Q by implication. Means this is our first bracket, this is our second bracket. We have to join these two by implication. Now, use Q. First two, second false, implication is false. We have to remember the truth table of implication which we already learned in the previous video. So true false 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 true implication is true. When both are false, implication is true. False true implication is true. So in this way we construct the truth table of the given statement pattern. 
So this is first example, now consider second example.